Hi, welcome to Two Pico Ball and Beyond. My name is Vino. My name is Ryan. And we have something exciting to review today. We have the Gabba Rogue. So, Ryan. First impressions, yes. what are your thoughts? So this paddle is awesome. I mean, it comes I, with a paddle case yeah, as well. It comes with a really nice Over case. We'll start with that. Um, well I, designed. I, yes, I love black and red. So this design on it's really, really cool to me. Um, this paddle, where it shines, I would say is, it shines that there's no bad part about this yeah, paddle. Yeah. I, I mean, the power on it's solid. For the, um, this is a 16 millimeter yes, thick, yes. Uh, thick paddle. For that thickness, it plays pretty poppy, not quite as much as the Legacy Pro, yeah, yeah, yeah. but it still definitely has a lot more power than like the A Spade, for example, that we tried out. And a right really off the paddle. box, a very well-balanced yes, paddle, yes. very light. It's coming at 7, 8, um, very similar to a paddle that's one of our favorite, A Spade, yep. right? Uh, very well-balanced, good grip, like a solid grip, like yep. all around. It's a little bit more squarer, yep. wouldn't you say so? Yep. Like, you know, just holding it seems a yep. little bit thinner and squarer. Uh, but overall well built. Yes. So let's start off straight with dinking. Yeah, with dinking with this paddle definitely is, I would rate it like as like a, a B tier. So it has really good touch. There's definitely paddles that have a beat in the 16 millimeter uh, thickness category, but it still has very, it has a very nice touch to it. And I, I was really impressed. I think, you know, it's not a thermoform paddle, yep. but the the sweet spot seemed to be a little wider. It was more forgiving. Yeah. Um, I mean, you hit it forgiving. down in your handle. Yes, you don't have anything, yep. right? Not like yep. thermoform. But the sweet spot was rather wide. Yeah, It felt a little bit more poppier, almost like the surface was like double or triple layered. Mm -hmm. So like it easily pushed the ball out, but you still had good control. Yeah. Yeah, and we'll just jump straight into the reset. Yes, Since yes. we talked about, we're talking about the control game of the paddle. It's definitely still there, similar to the dinking, where it'd be like, it's it's great, but there's still some paddles that definitely have it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Very capable of having pretty good resets. Mm -hmm. But just once in a while, I noticed it would get that extra pop where it, it would go kind of a little higher than I'd expect yep. or want. Yep. But again, that would just take, um, it's just a little different than the paddle I played with. Yep. Yep. But definitely can perform resets very well. It had... Good power. Yes. I was very Great surprised power. about the power. I mean, for the amount of control that this paddle had to yep. offer, yep. it was one of those paddles that had that good, decent yep. control yep. and good power. Yeah. That's where I put both of them and just sticking exactly. up. Exactly. I said earlier, yes. they're yes. both at like that B, B plus range yes. Yes. as far as the, that, um, the dink game, the reset yep. game. And then the power is still, it's very good. Like I said, it's not quite at that Legacy Pro for that same thickness where that hits, it's a little more popular, but this is, that, right this yes. is that rate in between where we have it right here, that yeah, ace yeah. spade, then you have the rogue, and then the legacy yes, pro. Yes, yes, that's, yes. That's yes. kind of my And, and sometimes one of the biggest problems that you have is you have a really good power paddle but has no control yep. whatsoever. Yeah. And this, and is, this seems this to is, just yeah, be this there. This is the great yes. middle of the road. Fantastic. Exactly. It's, it's, it's great at both. Talk about spin. I was very surprised with the spin. Yes, you do feel a lot of texture to it. Yeah, so the spin on this paddle is, um, you know, really good. I mean, there are definitely, like I said before, couple paddles that have it beat. I mean, this paddle is no downfalls. Yeah, it yeah, generates yeah. a lot of spin, tons of spin. I mean, it, it was just like, oh my goodness. We tested a number of paddles today and this had more spin than all the other ones we tried. Exactly. It yes. had a lot of spin on it, on, on your serves, on, you know, trying to hit drop shots with some backspin. It's like, wow, this paddle. I mean, it really overall, gets a lot of spin. You know what this kind of reminded me of? The very first time about a year and a half when I took the Diadem Edge. Yep. It didn't scream anything over, but it did yeah. everything really well. Yeah. But this is like one of those pedals. It does everything to a higher yeah. notch, well it, balanced. Yeah. It, it, yeah, it, it delivers. Does, it does like everything. I mean, the spin, the control, the power, everything we look at on every paddle. We have, there's some paddles that shine where it is yes. the all-star. This is on every one of those categories. It's just like one little notch below. So it's like, okay, but if delivers, you want yes. the spinniest paddle or a little more power, okay, there, there is one if that's what you want, but there's a, a big trade-off where this paddle holds like a strong bar all and the way everything. across the yes. board. It's yes. well balanced. I mean, there's just, there's nothing yeah. wrong with it. And we, we got this paddle just to demo recently. I've already had quite a number of people pick it up and play yes. and they were very interested, especially people coming like from a tennis background, yeah. people that come from a different racket sport. It seems to have that balance that they're looking for. So definitely something to check out. 
Um, if you're around uh, the Rochester area, more than happy to demo this paddle. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. Uh, shout out to Ship Shots for letting us record here once again. And if you enjoyed the video, uh, please make sure to like and subscribe. So thank you guys for tuning in to another paddle review. Thank you very much.